Now, there's a lot of excitement in Bobby Wine's camp, National Unity Platform, and I'm gonna tell you why they are very happy. Victor Kamenyo's girlfriend has sworn never to return to him. Stand by for the details. <laughs> Now, a very good morning. Thank you so much for subscribing to the Buzz UG. And in case you haven't, kindly subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. My name is Melads Milo, aka Fuller. Now, there's a lot of excitement in the National Unity Platform camp after confirmed that DGF, Democratic Government Facility, will be closing its operations in Uganda by December. This was announced by Mr. Richard Todonk, the chairperson of iPod and the Secretary General NRM. Now, His Excellency Robert Chagulanyi Sentamu, the president of NUP, has warmly welcomed this move by DGF because their funds have sustained human rights abuses championed by President Museveni. Bobby Wine says President Museveni, in all the past years, hired experts in the international relations who would cover up his domestic rights violations. So why, why should we be pretentious? We, we don't like to pretend around, and that's why we said no to iPod. We wish those who think there is value in iPod well, because it's been around for over 10 years. But even with the over 10 years of iPod's existence, democratic space has shrunk as opposed to increasing. Civic space has shrunk. Our democratic credentials have gone much lower. So how do you tell me this thing is valuable? So those who think there is value in it, please go ahead. If you manage to get something valuable out of it, the country will thank you. But, but, but don't try and force us and say, you must be part of iPod as NEP. If you're not joining iPod, then you are undemocratic. You know, you don't love your country and, and all of that. <laughs> Now, in other news, His Excellency Bobby Wine is still trending after welcoming the decision made by the European Union to block the construction of the East African pipeline until the Ugandan government guarantees fundamental human rights for all affected citizens. Bobby Wine says the works so far conducted on the pipeline have caused great pain and suffering to the communities, especially in Bunyoro, where it originates. Bobby Wine says over 100,000 people have been displaced to pave way for the pipeline. Finally, Bobby Wine says as NUP, they believe no government should pursue development at the expense of citizens' rights and freedoms. Therefore, they join the European Union in asking Total Energies and other partners on the project to withhold their support until the concerns about the pipeline are addressed. <laughs> Now, in other news, Ebola is getting serious in the district of Mubende. Right now, according to reports, more 12 people are said to have succumbed to this problem. There are reports that at least five people died between Tuesday and Wednesday, some in hospital and others in the most affected sub-county of Madudu. Over 10 other patients are currently fighting for their lives at the Mubende Referral Hospital. Uh, recently, I told you that Ebola disease is very deadly and uh, if you ask the people of Congo, they will tell you that over 2,487 people have died in just a period of one and a half years. So I think we have to carefully listen to the Ministry of Health about this problem. Now, in other news, and this is coming from the entertainment industry, 
Recently, Victor Kamenyo's girlfriend stormed out of their home after Victor caught chatting with another lady on WhatsApp, suggesting to her that his current relationship with the current girlfriend is not serious. Now, in a voice note that I'm gonna play for you right now, the girlfriend says she's done with Victor Kamenyo, as in she's not going back. You know, she says she has sacrificed a lot for this guy, but it's very unfortunate that she said their relationship wasn't serious. Let's first of all listen to Victor Kamenyo's girlfriend, and I'll be back shortly. Tessie, all over. I want to have a single to my like, I want to. Smile away, such a good name, and come in your mobile door, moving to range. I will have a very good event. Where is that? Been been now screenshotting. I'm smearing your kinch cover once. Watch the girl and Garinga Gamma with German and you know, never would they. So it's better again. They were to jab up to man is a nest on your way. Watch the girl. Think of one saga and you've been to be a woman. You have not to live on to. Mubele dene at the end, wawa watu wata niso kungo kuma nilo gina angaya sama mayabichi, it's not that serious. Then katika chibere nga techili serious. Ewe newe tamzebe kubigundi kubitivu, tewali chingi, tewali ude wange wagenda funa deno, ne waitani. Chawe de, chawe de, ayama ni, kwa nisaga la nyuate kuma nila manu. Ni nami kwa ano ni nachi mba de mpostinga buli wamu buli mama nye bange Atika na hata niko kumanyi ila uchite gila Kati ya manyi Newa newa kula chini newa mtu newe munga mba chini Zewe sibi dako newa gina kutivi chukumi Taina changamba well, there you go. That is Victor Kamenyo's girlfriend narrating that, hey, you know, she's not going back to the guy. Uh, <laughs> yes, she has decided she's not going back to the guy. And actually, this comes after Victor Kamenyo appeared on Spark TV recently, you know, requesting the girlfriend to come back home and apologizing to her and uh, saying that, uh, you know, he's very sorry for whatever happened and uh, requesting that she comes back home. But it seems the girlfriend is not going back anytime soon. But of course, we hope that she comes comes down and return back home and uh, we wish Victor Kamenyo all the best in this very tough situation he's going through right now. Otherwise, this is The Buzz UG. As usual, my name is Melads Milo aka Fula and of course I'm asking you to subscribe in case you haven't and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. It's a bye for now. Thank you. Audio Jungle.